What's up, Peak Timers? Phil here from Peak Time Racing. Welcome back to another peg hunting video. I know it's been a while since we've done a peg hunting video, and honestly, the reason why is just because every time I've gone peg hunting, the stores have been pretty dry as of late. So we are at Fred Meyer today, and this is one of my favorite spots to go peg hunting, and we're really hoping today is the day that we actually find something somewhat interesting to show you guys on camera. Otherwise, I'm not gonna post this video. So if you're seeing this video, well, I, I found something a little bit interesting, hopefully. We'll see, we'll see. All right, guys, let's head on inside and I, I don't know what I'm looking for. I'm just looking for anything new, anything fun, anything that I don't have. So let's go check it out. All right, first things first, we've got a fully stocked shelf of Hot Wheels, although they look to be a little bit older ones. So let's have a quick look through. There's the new Grand Sport Corvette there. Okay, not bad, not bad. That's fairly new. What else do we have back here? Lots of fantasy cars. There's the Bone Shaker. What else can we find here? Some interesting ones. This Bone Shaker is really nice. Sorry, I like this one. What case is this? This is an E-case car. Okay, so that one's a little bit older of a car, but there's a mixture of some newer ones in here. There's the Honda City Turbo 2 in blue, Corvettes, the Porsche. All right, let's head on over to the aisle and see what we can find there. All right, here we are at the aisle. We've got a lot of nine packs there. There's some more cars on the shelf here. One dollar, of course, you can see the big sign that says one dollar. And here we've got the Gran Turismo set. Okay, this set's actually been here for quite some time and they keep restocking it. Although no McLaren F1 GTR, looks like somebody else got all the F1 GTRs. I, I took a couple of them last time. Here's a nice nine pack that we have. That Focus RS is so good. What else do we have in this one here? Ooh, that Porsche is nice. We got the Roadster. What else is in these ones here? Let's have a look through, see if we can find any. I want the one with the Indy Oval, the white Indy Oval. There's one with the uh, Lamborghini. Let's see what this one here. Yeah, that Lamborghini is very, very nice. I, I wish this Lamborghini would come into a single, but it's only in the multi-packs. I did get it already though, but we'll leave those ones behind. So none of the new multi-packs, but we'll move on. Here we've got some Disney cars. This is series three of the Disney set. And I actually have all of series two, three, and I'm missing two cars from series one. So once I get the two cars from series one, we'll do a full video. Doctor Strange, Lamborghini Gallardo. I've already, oh, sorry, I said Gallardo. This is a Huracan. Whoa, correct me, correct me. All right, there we go. So the Doctor Strange Huracan, I've already got that. Haven't unboxed it yet. We've got the Project 2 Cars Acura NSX GT3. I have that one as well, but we haven't unboxed it yet. So we'll unbox that when we can. Let's go on and see what else we have down the aisle here. We've got some of the Track Stars trucks. Oh, these are this one's new. Okay, this one's new. This is one of the new. Uh, looks like the Indy car, the or the F1 car. It's kind of a fantasy variation. It's not an officially licensed one in there. That one's pretty neat. Uh, we'll pass on that for now. Let's have a look through the five packs. Some interesting five packs, Street Beasts five packs. Uh, we've got this extreme one here, Street Beast back there. No, none of the newer ones in there yet. I'm not too interested in any of the fantasy five pack ones. Mystery Monster Trucks. So as you guys know, uh, Hot Wheels now is just making monster trucks. They don't have the Monster Jam license, but they're actually coming out with some really cool monster trucks. And now we've got the Mystery Series ones. What is this right here? Track Builder Display Launcher. Okay, so this is a little display case. Looks like it can hold three cars per side. And it's got a little launcher. Fits on your big Hot Wheels City type of track sets and stuff like that. We'll pass on that for now. We got the Curve Kit here, the Launcher Kit, and a Loop Kit. Ooh, I like the Loop Kit. I've got lots of these loops. We've got some loop videos coming up on the channel pretty soon, but uh, let's see what else we have here. W look at this one. Monster truck, this is a Roger Dodger. Check out the color on this. Giant wheels, it says on there. I don't know if it's like glow in the dark or something. Collect them all so you can see all of these ones right here. We still got the Bigfoot. More to that, here we go, here we go. Bigfoot, there it is. Giant wheels on the Bigfoot. Oh, look at more Bigfoots. All right, so Big Bigfoot's not a Monster Jam license car, so it's kind of an open license. They can still make them. We got a bunch of other ones here. Look at this one, four wheel drive. I like that. That's not very often that you see actual cars that have real four wheel drive. We got the Bone Shaker monster truck right here as well. Another Bigfoot and Rev Treads. And what else do we have here? Let's move on down here. We've got some Matchbox cars. 
what do we have here? Ooh, this Matchbox set is really nice. This is the five pack one. We got the SLR, we've got the Porsche, we've got, what is it, like a Cuda or something in there? Uh, what else do we have down here? We've got some new Matchbox packs. This is a nine pack. We've got an exclusive cars. Ooh, check this one out, the Audi. I think this is the RS4, I could be wrong. It could be RS6, but very, very nice. We got a couple of other good ones in there, the Hummer. Ooh, we got this one with the BMW M2 in there. There it is, or is it the 1M Sport? I'm not 100% sure, I think it's the M2, but that one's a really nice pack too. I haven't seen the singles of that BMW yet. I really want the singles of that BMW. Let's check out what we have down the aisle here. We've got some other ones. Uh, I'm not too interested. I don't really do the M2 cars. You guys know me uh, every now and then. Ooh, these Fast and Furious ones. Check these out. I think these are 1 in 36 scale. I'm starting to get into more of these a little bit bigger cars here. We've got the Brian's R34. Oh, I love the R34. It looks so cool. What else do we have down here? We've got Mia's Acura Integra. And ooh, ooh, is this Dom's car right down here? Yes, it is Dom's Dodge Charger RT. What else do we have back here? Oh, there's the Eclipse. Yes, Brian's Mitsubishi Eclipse. I love that Eclipse from the first Fast and Furious. We got the Supra, Brian's Toyota Supra, and another Eclipse. And what is this one back here? Let's pull this one out here. Oh, that's really cool. Letty's Plymouth Barracuda. Oh, yes, I love that, love that. All right, let's see what else we have down here. We've got some 1 in 36 scale cars. And like you guys know, I've been collecting quite a few of these. I'm looking for some different ones, more into the exotics and stuff like that. Seems to be a lot of basic ones. I've already got the Ford GTs and stuff here. We've got the Mercedes. We got some shorty cards up here. Indy Oval, Land Rover, Series 3 pickup. There's the Porsche 918. Uh, ooh, Mercedes AMG GT3. Uh, there's the Camaro back there. Another AMG GT3. This Viper is really nice. I'm liking that. I'm dropping cars here. Let's pick up these cars that I'm dropping. Uh, let's see what else we have here. We've got the, uh, what is that one? That one's the Custom Ford Maverick. I almost thought it was an error, but it's not. And let's go on down and see what else we can find. We got Toy Story cars. Check these out. Wow. Toy Stories. This one looks like there's eight cars, but there's four in the initial release. I guess that's what it is. I guess they have all the other ones blocked out. Let's see if we can find all four. Woody, Buzz Lightyear, Alien, Rex. We're on the hunt for those ones. Let's see what we can find back here. There is Alien, I think it is. There's uh, Woody. Yes, we got Woody. We got Woody. Okay, okay, okay. There's Oh, there's Bud Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear, not Bud Lightyear, Buzz Lightyear back there. There he is, looking good, Buzz Lightyear. And what else? Oh, 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 there we go, there we go. We got Rex. We have all four, I think we have all four. All right, guys, back inside of my car, and I would have to say, pretty successful trip. There was some interesting stuff in there. Finally, there was some new stuff that we haven't seen before. So let's check out what I got. Now, you guys did see me look at the Toy Story set. So let's check out the Toy Story cars that I got today. We've got, uh, well, I'm just picking them up in whatever order I pick them up at. We got number three, and I have to read the names of them. This one is Alien. Alien number three. That one's pretty cool. All right, all right. And then we've got number four, which is... Rex. <laughs> I'm, I, I, I don't know the actual names of some of them unless it's Buzz Lightyear, you know, the, reg, the regular ones. All right, there's Rex. Rex is pretty cool. I have to admit, I haven't seen the Toy Story 4 movie yet, but once I do see it, I'll, I'll know exactly who all the characters are. But that's okay. For the purpose of the video, I'll show you guys anyways, and I'll read the back of the card. Of course, we have got Woody. Woody, 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 number one, number one, car number one, Woody, Woody, and of course, my favorite, Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear is my favorite. Here we go, number two of a Buzz Lightyear. So we are missing Forky, Bo Pete, Duke, Kaboom, and Ducky, and Bunny. And so those ones are gonna be probably in the second release of the series. So a pretty cool set. I love character cars, guys. If you guys don't know, I absolutely love characters. I think they're awesome. I like them way better than fantasy cars. Like fantasy cars are cool, but to make a car after an actual movie character, it's just, I don't know, it's just awesome. I love it. And the video game ones, like the Mario ones, they're so cool. The Minecraft ones, again, so cool, so cool. All right, guys, those are the only cars that I actually bought in Fred Meyer, but I did stop at, uh, where was it? Target, Target is where I stopped up before. And uh, I did find a couple of cars there. Not enough to film a video inside pet hunting, but, 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 I did find 
two Tesla Model 3s. Yes, I already have the Tesla Model 3, but uh, I buy multiples of castings that I really, really like, and I love Teslas. So the Model 3, I bought a couple extra ones. And uh, interesting story is white Model 3, a family member of mine actually just ordered a white Model 3. It should be here in about four weeks. So once it's here, I'm actually going to be doing some videos on the real life Tesla Model 3. We'll do some comparisons between the Hot Wheels version, of course, like we always do. And uh, so if you guys want to check out those videos on the Tesla Model 3, shameless plug to my vlogging channel, Peak Time Vlogs. I'll link that down below. So go go subscribe to my Peak Time Vlogs channel and you guys can check out those Tesla Model 3 videos once it arrives, you know, in the future. But pretty good peg hunting trip would you say yeah yeah i would say i would say it's a pretty good peg hunting trip thank you very much for watching this video make sure you guys smash that thumbs up and we'll catch you on the next one bye